Welcome back everyone, I am Bharat. I hope you guys are doing absolutely fine. In the previous video, we saw how to install Python plugin on IntelliJ IDEA. In this video, we'll walk through how to create a Python project on IntelliJ IDEA and I'll walk you through the project structure and uh, how to sync Python requirements and stuff. So without any further delays, let's get started. Firstly, let's open our IntelliJ IDEA uh, IDE. click on new project now here you can see we have this Python option now just for a sample let's create a Python project uh, let me okay let this be as it is let's just call it sample project choose Python and let's choose virtual environment let this be as it is, you can choose your Python versions. Let's click on create. So here you can see a virtual environment is created and these are some IntelliJ settings files. Now let's try to create a new Python file here in our project. New and a Python file. Let's call it hello.py let's just print hello world and let's try running this so there is some indexing and stuff going on so initially when you create a project or when you install some requirements and stuff it after the installations uh, the ID takes some time and uh, it does in this indexing and stuff so you can see a Python program has ex been executed and uh, you can see the output in the console here now let me show you the project structure for this uh, project over here that we created so in uh, PyCharm it is a little different the way we configure our uh, interpreter and stuff and uh, in IntelliJ it is a little different so this SDK here we have created our SDK for this project we have to go to this project uh, here tab here and in here let's choose the one which we created earlier and click on ok now you can see slightly there is a difference here Earlier we ran it using Python console. Now there's an option, uh, other option to run. Now let's click on this. You can see it is in the run tab. So you can go over project structure and uh, you can check out what are the libraries that are installed by clicking on SDKs and then packages. So this is how you can check what are what and all packages are installed within our uh, project. Also, you can have requirements.txt here and then use uh, this sync Python requirements to auto install whatever is uh, within your requirements.txt. In case you have imported any libraries here and it's not there in the requirements.txt, it also gives you the uh, auto hint that this particular package is not present in requirements.txt and uh, whether or not you want to add it to your requirements.txt. So that is it for this video guys. If you found this was helpful, hit on the like button, share it with your friends and drop your valuable thoughts and suggestions in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet and hit on the notification bell so you never miss out any of the latest updates. Thank you for watching. I look forward to meet you guys in the upcoming videos.